Okay, guys, so we're going to go ahead and remove this tube, dim, uh, tube dimmer, the annoying uh, ads on the bottom right-hand corner of your screen, and then it puts like other pop-ups, other ads, unwanted ads onto your computer. I'm going to show you how to do it on Google Chrome, Internet Explorer, and Firefox. Uh, this will get rid of it. So I'm going to start off on Google Chrome. So the first thing we got to do for any browsers, we have to go into the uh, ad remove programs, go into the control panel. And uh, I'm going to show you guys because a lot of uh, a lot of people aren't seeing uh, tube dimmer inside their um, programs here, and that's because what you have to do is you have to know who the publisher is. And the publisher, the culprit, is this this company here. It's called Creative Island Media, and you may have something in there. It, inside your, your ad remove program, it'll say like updater. Let me focus in here. It'll say updater. Created or uh, updater by Creative Island Media. You guys see that in there? Uninstall it. And also if you see anything to do with the word tube dinner, you want to uninstall that as well. Okay, so once that's installed, now the thing is if you guys aren't able to install it, what you want to do is go into your, um, your task manager and you want to kill that program. If you don't, if you can't find a particular program that's like running, what you want to do is just reboot your computer into safe mode, and then go back here into the add remove programs, and then look for this um, Creative Island Media updater or tube dimmer in your um, add remove programs, and then uninstall it. Now the next step, okay? I'm gonna start off with Google Chrome, and we're gonna do this, okay? So once you install that program, what you want to do is go into Google Chrome, and you want to click. Uh, this uh, three-prong horizontal bar and we want to go to settings and this is pretty much like an extension or like a plug-in or like an add-on so what we do is once you're on here you click on extension and right from here if you see um, tube, dim tube, tube dimmer or the publisher's name um, creative island media or tube dimmer what you want to do from in here is you just want to be able to uh, you want to delete it and then what you do from here is uh, you would just uh, shut down Google Chrome and then reopen. And if it's still there, what you want to do is you want to do a, um, a, a um, you want to reset Google Chrome. So I mean, for most of you, it's going to be gone already. But if, if you still have it, what you want to do is you want to click on this next button, go to settings, and you want to go all the way down. And we're going to reset uh, Google Chrome. Go down to show advanced setting. And scroll all the way down to the very last one, and it says reset browser settings here. Now, what you want to do is you want to reset your browser. Now, the thing is, when you once you reset your browser, it's it's going to restore it to original defaults, and whatever favorites and stuff you have on there is going to be all deleted. So this will be the last step. So if the previous step, the two previous steps didn't work, then you want to do this as well, and that should clear uh, tube dinner. So uh, so okay, next one. Let's move to Internet Explorer now. Okay, so open up Internet Explorer, and then we want to click on this top right-hand uh, wrench here, or maybe a three-prong horizontal bar. Go to uh, Manage Add-ons, and right here in the Tools and Extensions, uh, if you have anything to do with um, Tube Dimmer, or again, the publisher's name, Creative Island Media, what you want to do is you want to disable it, okay? And then after here, what you want to do is shut down uh, Internet Explorer and then reopen. Hopefully, it's gone. Uh, make sure you open up a new tab. Make sure it's not in a new tab as well. If it's still there, what you want to do, the next thing is uh, reopen Internet Explorer. And then what you want to do is you want to go, uh, you want to reset your browser. So click on that wrench again. Go all the way down to Internet Options. And from this page here, click on Advanced. And look down here, it says Reset. You go ahead and reset the page. Uh, after you reset it, close that Internet Explorer and then reopen. And that should be the, the last step if the previous step didn't work to get rid of uh, Tube Dinner. Okay, so next thing, last one, Mozilla Firefox. Okay, open up Mozilla Firefox, and, and remember, uh, you've, you've already went to the control panel, and you've deleted the uh, publisher's name and the YouTube dimmer. And so then after you, you uninstall the programs, then you open up Mozilla Firefox. And what we wanna do this time is we wanna go into the menu bar. Uh, if your Mozilla Firefox looks like this, you don't have a menu bar up here, the, the tools, just right click up here and click on menu bar. And then now what we'll do is we'll click on Tools and we'll go to Add-ons. And then right here, it should, it should be under Extensions. It's loading right now, give it one second, okay. Click on Extensions. 
and then make sure um, tube dimmer or anything to do with this publisher's name, Creative Island Media, you want to get rid of it. Also, what you want to do is you want to check on your plugins as well. And because, I mean, the reason is because this program actually attaches itself to Mozilla Firefox at first, and then it can spread to IE and Google Chrome. So look under here, but in here, what you want to do is uh, never activate. So the cre Creative Media Island or Creative Island Media or YouTube Dimmer, any of those uh, those words in here, you want to never activate it. Now what you want to do is you want to close Mozilla Firefox and reopen. Open new tabs, okay? Now for most of you, it's going to be gone, but if it's still in there for you, you guys want to do one more step and it's basically reset your um, Mozilla Firefox browser. So if, you've, if you open up a new tab and whatnot, and that's that the, the you still see uh, Tube Dimmer on the bottom right-hand side, those ads popping up, what you want to do is you want to reopen uh, Mozilla Firefox and you want to reset it. Uh, you just go back to the main page, click on help, and we'll go down to troubleshooting information. And on this page here on the right-hand side, it's going to say reset Firefox. You want to reset this. Now, the thing is take note. It's going to reset everything to the way it was originally. And all your favorites and stuff, guys, it's going to be gone. Reset it. And then... Um, And then once it reopens back up, it should be gone. Any comments or anything, just comment below. If this helped you, any subscriptions and likes would be great too. All right? Thanks, guys. Bye.